Look in the mirror and sing this song. Sing, I will be brave. I'll be vegan from now on. Look in your heart and sing this song. Sing, I will be brave. I'll be vegan from now on. Eat only healthy vegan things. Never eat anyone's arms, legs, or wings. Don't eat anyone who has ears or eyes. Make sure when you eat that nobody cries. Break cold habits you had for years. Save animals from so much terror and tears. Train yourself to always be in the mood to only buy healthy vegan. Good morning, I'm responding to comments today. Here's what you say. You're asking me if I respect people who aren't vegan. Well, let's go over what the word vegan means. Being vegan means being kind to animals, not paying people to hurt them. So let me ask you the same thing. Do you respect people who hurt animals? Do you respect people who kill cats, for example? I guess you would probably say no. Do you respect people who hurt dogs? You'd probably say no. So why is it that you respect people who hurt pigs? Completely unnecessarily. This isn't a matter of self-defense. To me, the word respect means somebody that I admire and I want to emulate their qualities. I have no desire to respect somebody who is cruel. Why would you? What a crazy question. Strange. Wash away your old life, be vegan today. Jump into your new life, it's the only way. Wash away your old life, be vegan today. Welcome to heaven on earth. Happy Vegan Declaration Day! I'm always in the mood to save animals and eat delicious vegan food. I'm always in the mood to save animals and eat delicious vegan food. I'm not a scarf model, I'm an animal defender, not a scarf model, I'm an animal defender, not a scarf model, I'm an animal <laughs> defender. All right, so basically you don't like my scarf. I get it, I get it. You made that pretty clear, but listen up. Here's the thing, okay? I have a ton of scarves because I get them all secondhand. And I'm not on social media to be a scarf model. I mean, I live here in Canada. I left the house this morning and it was really cold. It was freaking freezing. And now I've got like layers and layers of clothes that I've taken off because it just gets too hot later on in the day. So what I want to know from you is why are you not focusing on the issue at hand, which is not my scarf and other people comment on my hair and everything else. It is the animals. Go and watch the important documentaries. You're the kind of person who comes up to me in public and says, hey, can I have a picture taken? But you have no idea what I'm trying to say. Be vegan. Tofu scramble, tofu scramble, it's so easy to do, woo -hoo. Eating eggs is so last century, nobody needs to, so here's what you do. Mash tofu, green onions, and celery in a pan. Add black salt, turmeric, and spices, yes you can. Mix in some vegan mayo, mix in some vegan mayo. Now mix in a salty pickle. Yes, yeah, the way to go, oh, woo! Tofu scramble, tofu scramble, it's so easy to do, woo -hoo. Learn how to make it, cause saving animals will make them happy and will make you happy too. The egg industry's just a cycle of misery, let's make the animal holocaust history. The egg industry's just a cycle of misery, let's make the animal holocaust history. Tofu scramble, tofu scramble, it's so easy to do, woo -hoo. Learn how to make it, cause saving animals will make them happy and will make you happy too. Responding to comments today and you are asking me what stores I recommend that you buy vegan foods from. Well, I suggest you go to any grocery store. Usually when you walk into any grocery store, you'll notice that the fresh produce is all there. That whole gigantic section is usually vegan. 
right? You just go to any fruits that are there. Just think about all the fruits. Just picture them in your head right now. There's like a rainbow of colors. And then you go to the vegetables. And the same thing, there's a rainbow of colors. And just start stuffing them in there, particularly the ones that are green. You wanna get some kale, you wanna get some spinach, you wanna get some broccoli, okay? If it's hard for you to chew them, you're like, oh, I gotta chew all day, this is taking forever. Then blend them up, get a good um, one of those mixer things. You know, you grind them up raw and then you add some sauces to them, some vegan sauces, like vegan mayo, and that helps. Um, but yeah, the grocery store has everything. It has tofu, lentils, beans, chickpeas, rice, oats, has nuts and dates and has everything. Call vegan. This is an animal who didn't want to die. This is vegan food. You should give it a try. This was someone's baby that should make you cry. This is vegan food. It should make you smile. It's something you should buy. Chia seeds have omega-3. Come on, sing this song with me. Chia seeds have omega-3. Grind them up and sing yippee. As you see them in your pancakes, your oatmeal, and in your daily smoothie. Black seeds have omega-3. Come on, sing this song with me. Black seeds have omega-3. Grind them up and sing yippee. As you see them in your pancakes, your oatmeal, and in your daily smoothie. responding to comments today and you are telling me that I am the reason that you will never be vegan. Well, let's back it up for a second. First of all, remember that you were born vegan. You never wanted to hurt animals by nature. Your mother's milk was meant for you and every time you looked at animals when you were little, if you saw a cat or a dog or a pig or a squirrel, it didn't occur to you to take a bite out of them, okay? You were born vegan. What happened is you gradually over time started eating animals against your will and now you're kind of addicted to it and stuck there but you can unstuck yourself and you're saying that you are going to not be vegan because of me that makes absolutely no sense i'm just a woman here on TikTok talking about veganism and not hurting animals and i cannot make you into a good person if you want to decide now on your own that you want to keep hurting animals that's up to you you understand? It's nothing to do with me. Sorry, it's just true. End speciesism, end speciesism, end speciesism, be kind to the animals. End vegan phobia, end vegan phobia, end vegan phobia, be kind to the activists. Dance if you're vegan, hands up if you're vegan. Think you can't do it? Try it, you can. Vegan dogs are normal in every way In fact, they're healthier than most So order vegan kibble today Why pay for murder if you don't have to? Stop making excuses and just be vegan too Hi! I'm responding to comments today and you want to know where I got this wig. Well, this wig here it's actually given to me by God or Mother Nature or whatever you call him or her. You probably have one yourself. You know, just grab something here and just like pull. Okay, another word for it is hair, just in case you didn't know. But you know, let's talk about the deeper meaning about your question. So you're asking me about that because you want to avoid the subject of veganism, which is about being kind to the animals. You don't want to look in the mirror at what you're doing, so you're trying to find fault with me physically. Now, as mature people, we should be able to differentiate between the way a person looks and what they're actually doing. You know, because that's kind of like discrimination. Like, let's say I was bald and you were pointing that out. It would have nothing to do with the animals. You know? So how about you just be kind and be vegan? So easy. You can do it. doesn't mean that you just do your best not to eat, wear, or use animals. Being vegan also means you bravely speak out to defend them. Hi, so I'm reading comments today and you're telling us that you eat halal meat. Well, I googled halal meat many years ago to find out what goes on 
And if you actually look at the undercover footage, you will be horrified, absolutely horrified at the way these animals are treated. There's no right way to do the wrong thing. There's no right way to murder somebody who wants to live. These animals want to live. They don't want to die. They are here for their own reasons. Animals are here on the planet with us, not for us. They are not commodities. And you can absolutely choose to eat anything else. In Halal, they don't st stun the animals before they murder them. And that is actually against the law in many countries, but they make religious exceptions, which I don't agree with. Regardless of your religion, you can be vegan and you can start now. Call vegan. This is an animal who didn't want to die. This is vegan food, you should give it a try. This was someone's baby that should make you cry. This is vegan food, it should make you smile. It's something you should buy. Broccoli, green peppers, mushrooms, tomatoes, artichokes, vegan meat, vegan cheese, ta-da, it's vegan pizza. My vegan dog is still alive, look at her run, look at her thrive. If my dog can be vegan, so can you, if my dog can be vegan, so can you.